Hello everyone, welcome to the Cash Foundation Nigeria. My name is Alex Ibrahim. Today I'm going to show you another version of the Alex bit that's been configured internally to achieve the same result as the previous one, like I told you. Okay, now um, I just want to show you the reactor that there's nothing hidden in it. This is the reactor. This reactor is configured in two ways. You have this one, which is the supply, and then this one is the demand. So this one creates a demand from this side of the reactor, it creates a demand. And then this one is where the supply, this one is where you get the, the energy from. All right. I want to show you that this socket here functions. It works. You see when I put it on, lights on, and then it's off. So now I'm going to hook up the reactor, and then we're going to see what happens. Okay. Now the reactor is on. You see the my um, induction cooker is on. So the reactor, this is the one that's nothing special in it. And then this is the um, the meter. You can see we're getting 200, and I'll show you properly, 236.5 volts. And then see the little ping pong ball is running. And then the induction cooker is on. So you see that there's no trick in here. There's no trick. It's the same thing. See, it's just a little reactor. Okay. And the clip are coming on. And then you still have it at 210. So the induction clip has gone. The clip is gone because of the noise. It's just a stop it. I'm good for the work. So what I'm saying is that you can internally configure the reactor, your Alex Beach reactor, to achieve the same goal as the one that happens naturally. Okay. So that's about it. Show you this 337 volt. It fluctuates 240 point something all volts now. Uh, the reactor is running, and then the induction cooker is on. And then if one you can see put on the, so the demand. So you can see the. So that's about it, folks. All right. Thank you very much for passing by. Bye.